Hey there, bug watchers. Welcome back to BuggyBot Plays XCOM: The Long War. I uh, I had a bit of issue of an issue recently with some recording. Uh, one of them just didn't come out right. I, I don't know what happened to the file. It just something went wrong. It did not it did not record appropriately. It is it's really not worth showing. But uh, you guys didn't miss a whole lot. We we pretty much had one mission. Uh, Nothing too exciting happened. It was a light, you a light abduction mission with like eight or nine aliens, and I think we got a couple of we, we got a couple of uh, promotions out of it. Namely, we got Quasimofo here, turned him into an engineer. We gave plot armor. Uh, we gave her what was it called? Drone repair. And there was a third upgrade. Someone else got someone else got promoted. Ah, Evil Eagles. We're turning Evil Eagles into a specialist, an Overwatch specialist as a gunner. Um, beyond that, you didn't miss a whole lot. I uh, I sold a bunch of metal because I got a crap ton of it. And I know that's a little bit foolish, but I ended up building. I finished my thermogeny, and I'm starting a foundry, which I feel I may be more than a little behind on. Um, I don't think we actually missed out on anything else. Now, we had to let a UFO go. There is a medium floating about that I, I am just, I'm too afraid to go after. I, I see all these, all these, uh, unfortunate, <laughs> unfortunate, uh, what do you call them? Interceptors not doing so hot and I felt that maybe it wouldn't be smart to go after a medium UFO when I don't even have them equipped with laser cannons yet so this guy is getting away on the other hand Contact. we had a landing happen and we're getting ready to send a crew out for that um, it's a small scout UFO and I'm sending mostly mostly guys I want to level up, and I'm kind of just hoping that it's not a, a trap UFO. Um, the crew, as you can see, we've got LSD, Doomguy, Thunderpunt, Thaddeus Toad, Escarian, Juan, and Boom Shalaka. And now that I look at it, Juan Hernandez, I, I believe I had a special request here, and we're gonna nickname her Neo because she is the one. Yes, I'm actually okay with that joke. I I am so behind being the one. You're destined for great things, Corporal. Great things indeed. So let's get out there. Let's not screw up another video, and let's murder some aliens. I feel like that's a that's a lofty and good goal to have here. Operation First Star. No, no, no. This, this is, this is not the first. I can assure you, Mr. Mission Namer guy, we have had many of these missions before. This is not special. I know you like to think that every, every time is magical. This is not. Oh, I can see the UFO from here. That's kind of scary. These have a habit of going south if it turns out to be a trap UFO, because I will probably get murdered. Now, where am I? Okay. I know this map. I know where I am. Usually you start on the other side, but it looks like we, we've got it here. What we really should do is come back here, try to, try to keep to this back end, and circle until we get up to this area, where we've got a little cover, and more importantly, the high ground. Uh, this is a really dangerous particular, this is a particularly dangerous kind of map because it's real easy to get yourself caught out. So we're gonna go for a throw here and see if we've got anything to worry about. In the air. Over the ridge. It looks like no. That's, that's, that's a good feeling, I like that. Um, that being the case, we're going to get Ellis over here, and we're not going to feel too afraid to move our boys rather quickly. And 
and hopefully not run into anything. I think I think we'll be all right. I'm feeling I'm feeling confident. Battle scanners do that to you. Shut up. Listen. All right. What are we hearing? Definitely thin men. And maybe seekers. I think is what the is what the other sound was. The first sound was seekers, I believe. Moving. I never figured out what the hell seekers sound like. They're they're very confusing to me. It all sounds like scratchy disc records, and it's it's a little bit difficult for me to work out. I've always felt a little dumb for that, but uh, you know it is what it is. That's affirmative. All right. I'm gonna put you okay, right here, Ellis. Aye, aye, Commander. And move Got you up. Covered. All right, we, we're gonna get everyone up here. You know, I can't take this hill alone, boys. Let's yeah. do it. Okay. Copy that. Very good. No, no unfortunate activations. Not even really a whole lot of information. Now I'm hearing something to the right. Oh. What was that? It's your mother. You never write, you never call. And her in her condition. Oh, Iscarian. Call your mother. Be nice. She raised you. She put a lot of effort into this. Your mother's a classy woman. Let's see. Um, move you along. We're we gonna put. I think we're. Gonna, I think we we're gonna go ahead and move our way up this hill. And having this spot, we'll set up an Overwatch trap for hopefully whatever decides to wander through from the right. Now I'm doing a, a very intent job of intentional job of avoiding activating anything over there inside the UFO itself. I'm, I'm honestly pretty scared of that. Um, shit. Well. We have a very, very unfortunate situation here. Wouldn't it figure that the last guy is the one that does it? But here's the plan. We are going to go crazy with explosives until I'm pretty sure that this thing over here is dead. Because I, for one, am just not going to risk that son of a bitch going, coming up and over and just murdering one of my squad members flat out. Because that is exactly what's going to happen. Now, here's the thing. If it comes down to that, who am I killing? And as cold as it is, I think Thaddeus is the guy. So Thaddeus is the one who's going to freaking scout it out so I know where this guy is. And he's right here. Uh, it sucks to be you, Thaddeus. I'm sorry, buddy, but but you're the bait. You're just you're the one. Five down. And let's go ahead and remove one of these. We are going to save you because I believe you have heat. No, you do not. You have shredder ammo. Boom shalaka. Buddy, it's on you. That was a really unfortunate activation. And I immediately regret it. But we can figure this out. Um... First off, we're going to go ahead and get rid of you. 
All right. Now, do I go into Overwatch? I think I do. I think I could flush. But I think I go into Overwatch instead and hope that that alien comes to me and I get the shredder ammo on the, uh, the cyber disc rather than the drone. Because the drone isn't that important. And the freaking... Oh, well, at least we got the Muton. That was a pretty lucky shot. At least we killed him. But that still leaves us with a very pissed-off Cyberdisc. And a very angry... set of... Oh, Jesus. Well, this is gonna suck. One. You're not dead. I'll be honest kind of surprised. Really, really impressed that you are not in about 50 billion different pieces. So, good on you. Way to, uh, to break the mold, buddy. Now we're just going to have to go crazy on this thing. I think what we do is I could hit, I could do Shredder. And I'm, I'm considering it, but for the fact that my damage is going to be so crap. I would really rather my Shredder be better than that. Um, fuck it. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to crit him first. Then I'm going to Shredder. I did not crit. That is really freaking crappy. He should, however, be auto... Yeah, he is, uh, however, auto... A uh, hollow targeted. Now we're just going to have to put everything onto this guy. Yes, Commander. There we are. Come on. Tear him the fuck up. Come on, buddy. Now is not the time to be missing. Damn it. it really is not the time to miss, buddy. Oh god, this is, this has gone south really fast. All those times when I've gotten incredibly lucky. It's, uh, it's all coming to roost, guys. It's, it's time to get even. 98% to kill the Cyberdisc. I'll take it. And he took two damage for it. Oh, don't be such a baby. It was just a little explosion. Okay, I think now, rather than take a shot at a stupid freaking guy who probably won't kill anyway, I may drop a smoke grenade. Alright, well here, we're gonna, we're gonna at least do this. I could deal three damage, but I'm really worried that the damage reduction is going to keep that from, from working out. Alright. Pretty sure we're going to lose one guy here. Honestly, that was just just the worst kind of activation possible. And I, I can't really blame anyone but myself for that, for that little misfortune. Suppression. Okay, that's not bad. Excellent. Okay, it was only three damage. It's not bad. That's the kind of thing we can take care of around here. All right, all right. I feel good now. I'm, I'm feeling good. I think we can. I think we've got this. I think we've got this under control. Fantastic. And there's there's the sound of that uh, thin man pod. Okay. So how are we going to handle this? Well, we need to do this kind of in order. Um, Ellis is going to pull out a rifle shot. Let's see, who's, who's suppressing? That's the one suppressing him. We're going to take a shot with... We're going to like, take a shot with Ellis on him. Good shot, Ellis. Way to nail it, buddy. 
that frees up Doom Guy, who we can use. You're, are you still? No, you're not suppressed. Are you? Dang it! I shot the wrong one. I thought I had it right. I'm an idiot. Ugh! How unfortunate is that? Okay. Then we're gonna take a shot with Thunderpunt, who has pretty good aim, and therefore pretty decent chances to to nail this guy. There we go, Thunderpunt, to the rescue. Now we're going to use Flush to get rid of this stupid sectoid from his suppressing. There we go. Yeah, that's right. Run away. And we'll have Boom Shalaka step up and take care of this guy. Or not. You know, just whenever he decides to get around to it. I, I really didn't mean right now. I, I meant, you know, whenever he felt like would be a great time, obviously. I'm, I'm unconscious. I don't think you get much calmer than unconscious. There we go. I'm gonna fix everything, calm down. She is unconscious. She is not doing anything. So it turns out the one might end up being turned into our next uh our next what, what do you call them our next candidate for shoot why can i never think of words when i'm trying to just do very simple tasks our next candidate for chop shop for cybernetics so we're going to turn you into a mech probably we need a pathfinder eventually we're gonna we're gonna make sure we get one all right we have two floaters back here that are on overwatch we've got one sectoid here and another sectoid that we that we didn't quite kill sitting back there now what are my chances of blowing this guy away not too great however i don't believe doom guy is going to suffer too much if I move him up a step and he did not now why did I do that you might ask because I want to put nope never mind thought maybe I could put him there I am NOT going to that that's unfortunate that's okay we'll move these guys up and we'll have we'll have a scary and take a shot from back here really I don't expect him to land a decent shot what I want is that hollow targeting so that I got a better chance with, say, LSD. Well, I would really love to land that 60%. Come on, buddy. Do me a solid. Do me a solid, guys. We need this. Trust me, we definitely need this. We do not want this Muton running around. There we go. There we go. Okay, you've got a 61% chance. And you're the only two left. I think what we do is we actually put you guys, we put you on Overwatch. We have you take a shot. No luck. All right, he take, he's taking a fire on Toad. Toad made it. All right, good, 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 good. I'm pretty sure there's still another, another set of, uh, Another set of thin men out there. I'm almost positive that's what I'm hearing. Alright, you're gonna have to reload. You're gonna have to reload. Uh Doom got you know what? We'll take that 50-50. And it paid off. That's fantastic. Now let's move Ellis up. Let's have him reload. And we're gonna have you reload. We're back in. We're nice and nice and loaded. We've finally dug ourselves out of that terrible hole. You know, th things are looking up, guys. Fire. I would have laughed very heartily. There it is. Two Seekers? I believe two Seekers, a Sectoid, and one Thin Mint. 
I really like that about Long War. One, one of my one of my favorite things about it was that they they up the ante with all the different kinds of uh, with all the different kinds of aliens that you'd run into in a single pod. I, I don't I never talk about that much, but I I really really like it. It's something that I I really appreciate in the game. It's one of the best parts of the mod, in my personal opinion. All right, who's our biggest danger? I think our biggest danger. Oh my God! One. Uh, you look a little surprised, my friend. Let me let me get a better look at that. Oh boy. For a second there, she was pretty bugged out. <laughs> she was not looking good, folks. All right, let's see. You know what? That rocket might be appropriate right about now. Um, yeah, let's let's do this. Take us home, Thunder Punt. Come on, buddy. It's all on you. That's it. That's my boy. Awesome. Have you you've already taken a shot, haven't you? No, that's who that's who I was looking for. All right, you. You're gonna heal up Ascarian, so that he can start being a little more aggressive with that shotgun. And now I need to make a decision on who we're gonna shoot at. We're gonna we're gonna take a shot at the. There we go. Yeah, I think we're gonna hit that floater. I think we're gonna move. I'd like to move Doom Guy to a place that's a little better, a little better suited to to being safe. But I don't think we can risk it. Ran him down. Excellent. Alright, we're gonna move Iscarian over here. I don't think we can take the shot, but I do think we can grenade him. Uh on second thought, we may move Iscarian back. I don't I don't really want that that sectoid to get much more of a shot on me. Right, there's our sectoid. Now, this is really one of those missions where, you know, you're playing and you realize you got too cocky. And I did. I got too cocky. And look what happened. I got horribly jumped by that... Uh... Oh, uh-oh. Uh we're out of ammo with him. I got horribly jumped by a very unfortunate uh, I'm on the move. activation on on that cyber disk. Then I had several other activations pop up and say, oh yeah, you thought it was bad then. Well, we're about to make it worse. And it's kind of like, you know, the game telling me, yeah, you remember when you thought you were a badass? Well, yeah, um, we're here to remind you, you suck. You suck pretty bad, actually. We're not impressed. You can't... One thing about Long War, you really can never count yourself too far ahead. Things don't... Things don't loosen up like they do in vanilla. It's... It's pretty... Pretty much a consistent wave of, I fucking hate you. Okay. Damn. Four more Thin Men. This is a hell of a landing. I'll be honest. This has a lot of aliens. Um, no, I don't want Juan Hernandez. Yes, I, I like that her eyes are all buggy and weird, but honestly, she doesn't serve me much purpose right now. Damn, missed an 80%. That sucks. All right, how am I going to handle this? Well, first things first, I think we're going to have to get... We're going to have to pull him. We're going to have to pull... Uh... We're going to have to pull Iscarian back. I think he's too far forward. I don't like how much half cover my guys are fighting from. Why don't, why don't, I, why don't I spend some time on fixing that? Copy that. I'm going to move you here. I'm going to move Doom Guide yeah. with you. And you're gonna heal Doom Guy. Come on, time to cowboy up. Now. We don't really 
have much of a shot. I need to. I need you to reload. Scarion. Actually, you know what? I think I'm gonna put a Scarion over here. And his purpose is to make sure that that guy doesn't get a decent flank on anybody. I think that'll. I think that will serve quite well. And here comes. Oh wow, he has way more chance to hit than I like. With those with those kinds of numbers, someone's gonna someone's likely to land. And I don't like that. Yeah, there's another thirty percent. Oh no. Oh no. Guys, three thirties is ninety. I know that's not how statistics works, but it is basically like saying statistically, sooner or later someone's gonna nail it. And I'm so worried about that fact. And there's the second Seeker. I think that was a dash move. No, it wasn't. Okay. Okay. Alright, we're, we're in this. We're still in this. We're actually in a pretty good position to, to make sure that somebody... Somebody eats shit. How aggressive do we want to be? I think it really kind of depends on what we land out of this. That is encouraging me to be pretty damn aggressive. Um, Alright, yeah, you know what, Boom Shalaka, you take that shot, take out that Seeker. Good work. That's, that's the engineer showing that he knows just what to shoot. And we'll have Thunderpunt take his chances on this. Fantastic. Now the follow-up is that we're going to have Doom Guy step up and flush. I'm sorry. Are you a turd in the punch bowl? Because you getting flushed. That was a terrible, terrible joke, but I'm definitely going with it. I'm so happy I made it. <laughs> All right. Um, Ascarian has done his job. It's time to get him the fuck out. There we go. Excellent. I like it. Feels good. Feels good, guys. And Iscarian didn't panic. That's a really good... That's a bonus. That's a good, that's a good plus to this whole situation. Uh, I think we've got pretty good chances of surviving now. I believe we still have a sectoid out there somewhere. But we're definitely down to just the two... Just just the two uh, thin men, which is pretty good. Oh, forgot. Reloading does indeed cause you to... Cause you to, to take some acid damage, so that was unfortunate. That was, that was not smart. You're going to go over here, so now you have better cover, because I really don't want you to die. I'll tell you what, guys, I'm going to be real happy when that freaking, uh... Oh, there we go. When that armor finishes, because we are in desperate need of it. Okay. 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 Who's, who's running up here to see what the hell is out there? Oh, I don't like this. I don't like that I can't see anything. Alright, Boom Shalaka. Be brave. Where did those last two Thin Men go? Where did they go? I really don't know. I don't know where they got to, and that, that really freaks me the hell out. My guesses would be that they ran inside here. And it looks like they did. Now I'm terrified that they're going to flank me. And rightfully so, because they come through there. I'm in trouble. And indeed they did. But they did not flank. And we got one on the reaction fire. Way to go, Toad. 
These squaddies, I tell you what, they're holding up really well for a bunch of uh, for a bunch of newbies who I didn't expect to really have to go through this much resistance with. This this scouting mission has been pretty rough. All right, we're gonna put you here. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna spend another round here, hoping the last one. Oh, there's that sectoid. I knew there was another one in there. Yeah, Toad, buddy, you are impressive today. Reload, reload. I believe you are now. Yeah, all right. You're in a much better position now, Iscarian. Now we just gotta find that last, that last thin man. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Spend, we'll spend around here and then we'll move up. Okay. This is risky, but I'm gonna go with it. There he is. All right. There's our, there's our outsider. Um, let's see who has a shot. I believe you might. Indeed you do, and I like that very much. Okay. All right. How do I want to handle this? Um, personally, I think we just get really aggressive. I think we set a bunch of guys up for an overwatch trap. We keep them scared. There we go. And we lure him out into this horrible shit fest of overwatch and hope that somebody nails him. And then it all gets soaked by the freaking thin man. Oh no. Oh no, did my plan? Oh wait, did it hit the other? I think it just acided the, uh, the outsider. That's fantastic. I'm, I'm all for that idea. Please. Outsider, please be, please be terribly acided and unable to fight. And I don't believe, yeah, you don't have a shot anymore. However, you can step up. Copy that. Get up there, Iscarian. Scare the bejesus out of him. Strike the fear of God into him. You got it, 50-50. Um, why don't we move Ellis to here in hopes of getting a shot? And we do have one. Guys, we have a shot. Okay. I think, I think we gotta take that. Between the acid and all the pressure, I think, you, I think we're gonna be okay to push up on him. Run you here, and you'll be moving up there next round. Come on, hunker or something. I, I don't care. Oh wait, yeah, okay. He's he's covered in acid. Overwatch an opportunist. He's gone up in the world, hasn't he? Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna blow this wall. The hope is that I do enough to eliminate all the cover here, or at least open it up and make it likely that uh, more guys can see inside. Doesn't look like it really worked out. That's okay. You know, that, that's not the worst thing that, could, that happens. Let's go ahead and take the shot. And it looks like we crit, so it doesn't matter. Woo! 21 on a freaking... On a freaking scout. That is a hell of a scout. And we almost lost a guy. I know we've got some wound times. I'm, I'm not looking forward to that. But overall, that was, that was a dangerous but fun mission. Oh, man. I tell you what, guys. These Friday episodes, they are, they're turning into something. They're pretty cool. Um, yeah. We've got two guys out for two weeks, and that's fair enough. And Neo is out for 42 days. Wow. Honestly, I'm just impressed that she lived through it. She deserves, 
She, de she I think she deserves a promotion just because, holy crap, she managed to hold it together. So let's see what we got here. Uh, I'm gonna go my usual, my usual suppression route. I really like that. Now, this is a choice. Oh, how am I? How am I dealing with this? I think what we're doing here is we're turning Thunderpunt into a robot destroyer. And that means Shred Ramo, Heat Warheads, all that fun jazz. So I think we're gonna give him a Shredder Rocket. Next time, we'll give him Mayhem. I just want a, a little more pain and destruction from him. Ellis. Ellis certainly earned his, his uh, work today. And I believe we're turning Ellis into a snapshot sniper. I'll have to check the other snipers just to make sure, but I believe that's the plan for him. And then, boom, Shalaka. Buddy, you're, you're going to be a sapper. I'm, I just, I want more of you. All right. A cyber disc wreck. It's pretty awesome. Two more muton corpses, five thin man corpses, three sectoids, three floaters, and a crap ton of lyrium and alloys. I like it. Even better, a couple of flight computers and a UFO power source. We seem to have damaged an auto laser, though. That's that's unfortunate. We can go fix that right now. So let's 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 go ahead and get on that. Please and thank you. You guys, help me out. All right. Pots and pans. You're one of our snapshot snipers. Looks like you're you're that guy. And Arn Jesus seems to be a standard sniper. So what else have we got? Lee is also a standard sniper. So I think that means that Arn that uh, Ellis is going to be. He's going to be a, he's going to be another snapshot. We've given him Lone Wolf. Let's give him snapshot. That sounds good. And you know, I think Ellis could use a new nickname. We've always said Ellis D, Mary Juana. We've got Molly Pills. I think the, the, obviously he's part of Cartel. So that's what we're gonna name him. That just that just fits. I like it. Okay. Well, that could have been a pretty ugly, a pretty ugly affair, but we got lucky today, guys. We got pretty lucky. Now, let's see what else I'm gonna end up with here. Um, we'll pass some time, get that laser cannon, and we need to send an extraction squad. We have 48 hours for an extraction squad. Online. Carry on. We can have body armor started in one hour, or in one day, and a laser cannon. I think we're going to go ahead and wait for it. So, laser cannon. Come on. Oh, I can trade weapons? No. I get a new, I get a new corporal, but I, I just can't afford that. Come on. There we are. Assign new research. We have phalanx armor, armor available, and we have alloy shivs. Reinforced. Okay. Um, now I think we need to get to work on some of these autopsies, these uh, xenogenetics, experimental warfare, all that fun stuff. So what's zero? How long is zero neurology going to take? Six days. Let's get a scout done because we really need. I appreciate your efforts to support. We really need some help in the air game. I've already put the new recruits to work Fine, in the lab. build items. Phalanx armor costs thirty. Let's go and make sure that we get some cash to pay for it. 
because we're going to need a few of those. Now, we've got a lot of flight computers. I think I'm going to sell a few of them because we don't really need that many right now. And I think we're going to sell some Illyrium because I can't really use it. So we're going to go down to 150. We're going to complete that transaction, and now we're just going to build a crap ton of Phalanx. How long is that going to take to manufacture a Phalanx? Seven days. Three, four, five, six, seven. That's as many as we can have right now. It's going to take 56 alloys, and... How much could I do it for? I could do it in three days for 84 alloys, but I don't think that's really worth it. There we go. All right. Now here's a question. Can I, can I upgrade a shiv? I don't think I can. I'd be curious about that. I'll have to check that out later, see if I can figure something out. Anyway. I think we get time. We're gonna go and we're gonna set up for this. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna get this heavy laser rifle, and then we're going to we're gonna see about getting our buddy out of here. Covert data recovery. Send extraction squad. Um, covert operative. Oh, it's a transmitter. So we're gonna have a we're gonna have a big one, a large structure. Boy, I wish I had more guys for this. I wish I had I wish I had mech troopers already. Alright, let's get let's get vicious with this. We're gonna want some of our best guys and some of our best equipment. Um Let's take Let's take McGee. She has served us you know what actually no, let's not take McGee. Instead let's take No, oh, take it. I just clicked her again. Let's take Monocle because he's got more HP, and Exalt missions tend to turn into attrition. So I want, I just want to be, let's actually, let's see here, let me, who else have we got in here? Got Cobra, and I got Gavino, let's take, let's take Cobra. Um, I think, I think we warrant Soaring Circus to lead this troop right now. And do we have an assault? I don't think we do. We also don't have a rocketeer. That could be dangerous. Let's let's go ahead and take a rocketeer. All right. I think we got the troops for this. Let's hope that this all this all goes okay. Um, let's give you since this is like I said. Exalt tends to turn into a war of attrition when you've got so many guys bearing down on you. I think... I think we, first of all, I think we need to make some items available. But I think we should be okay if we start giving our guys, you know, a, a better chance with, with the, the plating and just that touch more survivability. Um, we only have one heavy laser rifle, which I'm thinking we're going to give to Daka. That also means that I just don't want these guys to miss. So, yeah, Daka's got my, Daka's got battle rifle. We're going to upgrade you to heavy laser rifle. And let me see what that does here. 4 to 8, 8% 8 critical, 8 to, 8 to 11. Confers plus 1, but we reduce aim by 10 until the beginning of next turn. Excellent. Yeah, I mean... Really, with a plus six, that's a, that's a minus four to my aim. That's really not bad at all. Um, pots and pans, you're my snapshot. I really like that. So I think you're gonna you're gonna serve well on this particular mission. And we're gonna give you we're gonna give you smoke, and may as well just give you more aim. If I can kill them before they kill me. What's to fear, right? It doesn't look like I have... It doesn't look like I have any extra... Or I, I don't seem to have any laser shotguns, so... We'll deal without that. Um, Lord Hattius, you're looking good. Let's give you, let's give you a sawed-off, just in case. 
got a few we've got a little bit of smoke we've got several we've got our scopes active we've got lots of flash bangs all right i think this will do it well guys i hope you enjoyed the uh, video if you did feel free to leave a like you can subscribe for more content every monday through friday and join me next time when we take on egg salt